The recognized symbol of excellence, CAW Entertainment. This is one of the matches you have been anticipating. The long-awaited debut most recent CTS winner Darth Maul. This year's SCW tournament will face Cole McGrath in just moments. I am Lone Star for SCAW. After this match, we'll have been halfway through the first round. And it has been an amazing start to the 2K18 era. And we are set for the eighth first round match. The second half of the first round will take place next week. One down those remaining eight matches following. It's Cole McGrath. He won his first round match last year. So certainly Cole for victory. He's a good run in the CTS. And got himself signed. Now we are set for the debut. A highly anticipated debut. On the 2017 CTS. And a year later, he is here. He'd be the first CTS winner to make his debut in the SCW tournament. But here's a statistic for you. Keep in mind, only one previous CTS winner won his first SCAW match. And that was Deadpool. Defeated uh, another former CTS winner in Shazam. It's an interesting entrance. is the 8th CTS winner. The first five all lost their first match. Or did not win their first. PC Jones was a, a double count out in his first match. He didn't lose. Sam so was Captain Marvel. King lost his first match, Red Hood. 
first decision that she won the match. She got so disqualified for taking too much ass. How will Darth Maul fare in this engine? Ever. You just start the smash already? So we're gonna have this entrance every time he comes out here? Cole McGrath. I can't remember the last time he won a match. I think it was last the last tournament. It may be the last time he won. Uh, she's going right to work of suplex, and then uh, that was awkward. Where both these guys may have gotten hurt on that. That did not look good. And McGrath to the suplex. There's not much. I, what is there to say about Darth Maul? He's competed in a number of CAW leagues. This would be, in my opinion, this would be his his biggest stage that he has performed on in SCAW. Suplexes by Cole McGrath. A tie trifecta of them. And Darth Maul has not gotten out of the blocks here. It has been all Cole McGrath to start this match. That was a flashy entrance, but he's been no steak, all sizzle. No bite, all bark. It's not looking good for Darth Maul here. But Cole McGrath, you know, a He's been struggling for opportunities. Called out Brian Erlacher and got dominated. He lost to Boba Bo. He made his debut in the 2016 Match of Destiny. But then he missed out on the 2018 Match of Destiny not selected to participate in that was not too happy about it. Well he needs to blame himself. Instead he's blaming everybody else. Well now Dark Maul seems to have found his offense, which is good because he wasn't gonna win taking the ass kicking and oh the power bomb right there. And they got the shoulder now he rolls it into to the uh, Boston Crab or wherever he's from Crab Darth Maul the Sith Lord termed Crime Lord he's gonna look to, by any means necessary he's a skilled fighter but right now he's struggling against Cole McGrath. That could be Cole McGrath just motivated or all is struggling under the lights here of SCAW. Maybe it could be both. We may not find the find out for sure what the case is tonight, but. Winner of this match will face Hellboy in the second round. Hellboy defeated Homer Simpson in the first match of this tournament. We already know one other second round match. King will face Archie Andrews. He's more focused on the ref than his opponent, and that's not a good idea. I'm not gonna see some of the high cap. Oh, what a, that was like a stun gun right there. And get two count from Cole McGrath on that 
stun on the ropes. And a nice suplex there. It's a new era. It's a chance to... It's new opportunities for superstars. And we're seeing... We've seen some new faces already advanced around too. You mentioned Archie. Also advancing was Aquaman. And Lupin came very, very close. Being a big upset over the Prince of Persia. There's a shot by Cole McGrath. I think in terms of drawing first opponents, Darth Maul got a good op a, a good opponent here. As Lupin got a tough opponent. Aquaman got an easy opponent. Probably the easiest. Paul McGrath is bringing it here, it seems. Now, pulls him down. It was quite an entrance for Darth Maul. With the former crime, the former Sith Lord turned crime lord. Then struggled to get out of the blocks. It was dominated for the first few minutes, but now it's been an even battle. And oh, the suplex on the floor. My goodness. Following this match, we'll run down the remaining first round. That'll take place next week. It's, oh, it's an elbow by Cole McGrath. This counts up to seven, but because Cole McGrath went back to the outside, he's starting over. And now Cole McGrath is driving with the ball here into the end zone. There's a small package. He'd be again. Oh, but he was in the ropes. Ref called for a break. And out of the outside. Into the ropes, and here we go. Oh! Nicely done. Like I said, this is Darth Maul, who's appeared in a number of CEW leagues, but I believe this is his biggest stage, as far as I know. I think he did appear in SMF, I'm not sure. I can see Anakin face Kylo Ren, but. Making in the Darth Vader costume, and Darth Maul drops a knee right there. Now I think he just exposed that turnbuckle. Remember that can be used against you. I think. Uh -huh. At least uh, the scheme doesn't have that glitch. There's a two count there. Paul McGrath is, is a little frustrated now. He sees that turnbuckle is exposed. What is he going to do? A shot by... Now what are they going to do here? Oh, nice neck breaker by Dark Maul. And it was Cole McGrath. Oh, that was impressive. Dropped him right on his knee right there. And now, oh, what a move that was. Almost a choke slam and it got two. I don't see it was like a choke slam, but it didn't it didn't felt more like a Uranagi slam slam. I'm gonna try another cover, this gets one count. Oh he sends him to the outside. We're gonna have some more fun on the outside here, it looks like. So it's following this match, we'll be halfway through the first round. And then see some punishment on the outside, contact with the steps. Cole McGrath is down. 
And oh, that was impressive. Got distance on that jump. And now, arguing with the official. Wait a minute, just throw the referee out of the ring. Uh oh. This isn't good. No referee. Darth Maul is going under the ring for a chair here. And wait a minute, Cole McGrath's got the chair. Oh, that backfired big time. That backfired big time. And look at that. Oh, no. Referee conveniently coming to. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait a minute, the Ionic Vortex! That's it! Cole McGrath! He's gonna win this! He goes to the cover, hooks a leg! One! Two! No! Oh! He kicked out! Well, now Cole McGrath is angry at the ref! He's going after the referee! It's like he's lost his mind here. He, the Irish with the rep. The outside. Referee's not too happy about it. Cool McGrath is still hot about it. There's a punch. A jump it takes him down again. Oh, jawbreaker. Cole McGrath. Okay, seriously, enough of the... Okay, he's going to expose the turnbuckle right in front of the referee. Oh, nice suplex from the outside into the ring. And he's going to try and cheat here. And we got the shit he can get. He goes after the ref. Has to stop from going after the referee here. There should be no tolerance. If you abuse a ref, you should be disqualified. We've seen a lax of rules over the years. Oh, and that turnbuckle that Cole McGrath exposed. And the referee's admonishing him for it, so throws him out of the ring. And Dick, oh, well, you got to be kidding me. Enough of this already. Neck breaker by Darth Maul. He's got him. There's no ref. Maul is a care. Oh, hard into that exposed turnbuckle. And he's got him here. Referee get back in the ring. And this should be it. Oh no, he kicked out. And we continue. Both guys. Fighting dirty here. Wait a minute. Oh! I think there's a name for that move. I can't think of it right now. But well, wait a minute. I have I heard this move. He calls it the Wrath of Maul! He got it! And he wins it! Darth Maul has won! The former Sith turned crime lord. And he has won his SCAW debut just a second. CTS winner to do so. And he moves on to round two. The SCW tournament, and good luck, you get Hellboy in round two. Now he's coming to the outside here. He's joined with the official. And now he's going to show up with fans as well. He's got a chair. He's gonna take the referee with the chair. You wanna get the decision reversed? Cause that's how you get that to happen. He does not. That's more. 
work his way into the next round. And he'll face Hellboy, but let's go over the rest of round one. The dawn of the 2K era. First eight matches have been something to talk about. I'm sure the other half next week when they start will be just as thrilling, if not more so. Anakin will face Stake. The first round matchup winner will face Tommy Brissetti, who defeated the Ghost Rider. Tournament Jin Kazuma will face Doctor Strange. Jin Kazuma can win, he'll set up another matchup with Deadpool. Doctor Strange in his first SCW tournament. Victorious. And these two men have a long history of each other. They're going to go one more time in the new era. Casey Jones and Red Hood will go at it. And another first round matchup. And then the winner will face the winner of the match between hardcore champion William Wallace. Yusuke Urameshi. That's the love since the first round of the year, so don't pull him out. The match for two Iron Man. Take on the angry video game nerd. First time these two have ever fought each other. Should be an interesting matchup. Another first round matchup will be a member of the Celestials take on Ryu Hayabusa. Robin versus Ryu Hayabusa. Two have fought a few times before, I believe. Should be another solid matchup between these two. A spot in round two is up for grabs. And the Zero One Champion Tension is going to be defending that title against Gambit. Winner of the Robin Rio Hayabusa match will face the winner of this matchup in round two. Remember, the Zero One Championship is also on the line here. And she returns to the incident term after missing the previous one. Shazam and Mr. Clean, two showboating, dirty athletes, arrogant. A lot in common to these two men. This should be an interesting match, to say the least. Shazam and Mr. Clean. Remember that the quarterfinals, semifinals, and finals of the 2018 SCW tournament take place at Ascendance, take place in Charlotte, North Carolina, later this summer. Be sure to join us next week for the second half of round one. Until next time, I am Lone Star saying thanks for watching.